Kaylee Atwater is a very technical player. Uh, she's composed, she's good under pressure, uh, she's got great field vision, uh, she can spray the ball. We feel like she's got the ability to get forward and get back. And, you know, she's coming in to a really important uh, spot. You know, we have, we have holes to fill in the center of the midfield and feel like she can contribute uh, as soon as she gets here. Yeah, Marissa is a very athletic player that we uh, kind of have slated to play in the center of the back and as a wide back. Uh, we feel like she can certainly defend well, but one of the qualities that's most exciting about her is her ability to get up and down the field, especially in the wide positions. Um, Marissa's coming to us from Seattle, uh, played for a, a good local, uh, a good uh, youth club there. Um, so we're really excited about her adding kind of a different dimension to our team with her athleticism. Carly's a local player, right, from our backyard, and uh, we're excited to have her join, join our team. She's got a great frame. She's really athletic. Uh, we feel like she can threaten in behind uh, and, and run balls down, through balls, and, and she's a goal scorer. Uh, the other thing that I think makes her special is her ability to play back to goal. She's good back to goal, holding players off, turning, and finding you know, goal scoring opportunities. And the last thing that, that she'll bring to us that we didn't have this past season is kind of a threat on set pieces, especially throw-ins. So, um, you know, I think she can get on the end of balls, but I also think that she can provide certainly good service. So, um, we're excited to have fun with Rachel's coming to us from Hawaii. Uh, Rachel has got the ability to play any of the four corners, so we can see her you know, giving us depth at a wide back on either the right or the left side. And we feel like she's dangerous as well, uh, kind of on the top corners as a, as a wide left forward or a wide right forward. She's powerful. Uh, she's, she's a blue collar player that's got a great work ethic and she's, she's two footed. So uh, we, we feel like, you know, her versatility is going to be a big addition for us this upcoming fall. Madeline Moore uh, can play in the six as a holding central midfielder or in the eight as kind of a transitional central midfielder. She's got great vision. Um, I think she's the type of player that can make players around her uh, look even better. Uh, she's got the ability to, to see the field and, and move the ball and spray the ball for us. She's a technical player. Uh, she's coming to us from Canada and one of the most exciting parts of you know the, the recruiting process with Madeline was She's got aspirations to continue to play after college, and we and we love the fact that, you know, she's she's a soccer junkie. So Katie Haskins, uh, we envision her playing both in the back for us as a central defender. Uh, we feel like she's capable of playing wide as well, um, and can give us time in the center of the midfield. Uh, she's very technical. Uh, feel like she has a good soccer IQ and uh, we're hoping that she can make an impact right away. Juliana Carter is an exciting player. Uh, she's a natural goal scorer, and uh, certainly every team wants you know, as many goal scorers as you can have, but we also find that she's versatile and can play, play some in the center of the midfield as well. Uh, Juliana's coming from us from Texas, and. Uh, has played the ECNL level um, for a club career, so we're really excited about adding her to the to the program. Mm -hmm.